Does 200 times stronger nanoretinol ring true? The answer is no, and here's why. We know that any encapsulated retinoid is going to be stronger than a non-encapsulated retinoid, right? So what they are talking about is compared to regular retinol. Let's start with the fundamentals. Encapsulation doesn't magically improve potency, it improves stability and delivery. Every encapsulated retinoid, whether it's liposomal, microencapsulated, or nano, gets protection from degradation and allows for controlled release. That's why brands like Naturium produce encapsulated retinals that may actually outperform the flashy nano retinol. For any brand to claim that only their formula is hundreds of times stronger is kind of scientifically not accurate. The real variable is how efficiently the encapsulation releases active retinoid and whether you can actually tolerate regular use. So time release delivery plus skin compatibility means better real world results, not some made up 200 times more effective fantasy number. And I say that because there are no studies that this brand has released that are publicly available for us to actually be able to reference and say, yep, it really is 200 times more effective. You don't need marketing hyperbole. Look for transparency, delivery data, and skin-friendly evidence. If it isn't better than basic encapsulation models at real performance levels, then it's just noise. To be clear though, I'm not saying that their product does not, you know, deliver performance. We know that even an unencapsulated retinoid any, whether it's a retinol, retinal, something stronger, is going to help improve your skin over time, right? That's just fact. We know that for anti-aging, we know that for pigmentation. Encapsulation is only going to enhance that. So is the product going to work as a retinoid should? Yes. Is the marketing kind of hyperbole? Also yes. What does that mean for your purchasing decision? Look for what is the most effective for you if you need something stronger, if you need something gentler, if you need something at a different budget point. Don't just buy into the marketing. Those should be the drivers for your decision.